do want to get you up to date weather wise so that you'll know what to prepare for for today. It is going to be a cooler weather day than what we saw yesterday. Here's a look at radar for you right now. We've got a couple of the showers that are over the mid south where we see the green that some of the showers making it down to the ground. It's not everywhere, but if it's a little darker color here on radar, maybe a little bit of a yellow orange. Yeah, there are a few of those light showers making it to the surface this morning. Right now in Nashville, we are 45 and a wind north right now at around 7 miles per hour. 72 and 46 the extremes for yesterday and nothing in the rain bucket for Nashville for yesterday. Right now we head to Cookville at the hour. You are starting the morning right around 43. So clearing skies for this afternoon after some showers this morning with chilly air in place and temperatures falling around the freezing mark. Expect widespread frost tomorrow morning, but after tomorrow morning and past sunrise, chilly and lots of sunshine on your Wednesday. Highs today 57, Bowling Green 56, Lafayette 59, Cookville, McMinnville 60, 61, Shelbyville, and then 61 back over toward the Shelbyville area. Look at these temperatures for about this time tomorrow morning between 30 and 35, Nashville. Back over to Murfreesboro, Columbia, Dixon, right at or just above freezing. You're right at or just below freezing from Lafayette, Cookville, Crossville, back over into the McMinnville area. Meanwhile, over the next couple of days, after chilly weather today and still chilly tomorrow, when you compare to the normal high of 67, we will warm up a little bit, but the warmer air for Friday could help set the stage for a couple of thunderstorms Friday. A few storms by day, a couple of stronger thunderstorms are a possibility going into Friday night. But right now there is the morning weather map. Not a whole lot. The key story are some of the showers and the cloud cover that's in place. As I mentioned yesterday, just showing you this to put it on radar and we'll decide whether or not we need a storm five alert. If there is one good news with this is that the dynamics, while still looking like there may be some strong storms, aren't looking as strong or as uh, the stability not as bad this morning as it was looking yesterday. We're still several days out, so there's still a lot of time for that forecast to change and be upgraded or downgraded. For today, 61. For tomorrow, 63. For Thursday, going into 70 with patchy frost uh, for Thursday morning. There's the storm chance on Friday, 66. Saturday, 71 on Palm Sunday, 76 on Monday.